hi students <coughs> in this video we are going to discuss about euler's theorem euler's theorem euler's theorem okay before going this topic first let us understand what is homogeneous function already we learned the homogeneous function in puc 2 level so once again i will explain about homogeneous function no problem okay so first we will understand what is homogeneous function write down homogeneous function homogeneous function first write down definition of this homogeneous function <coughs> a function f of x comma y is said to be homogeneous function hf homogeneous function of degree hf means homogeneous function of degree n if f of lambda x comma lambda y is equal lambda power n into f of x comma y here lambda not equal to 0 a function f of x y is said to be homogeneous function of degree n if f of lambda x comma lambda y is equal lambda power n into f of x comma y here lambda is constant which is not equal to 0 suppose the function f of x y is satisfies this condition that means f of lambda x is equal lambda y is equal lambda power n into f of x y so then we can say that that function f of x y is called as homogeneous function of degree n okay <coughs> ah now let us see one example first one f of x comma y is equal y square plus 2xy y square plus 2xy you can observe here it is a function in terms of x and y now let us check this function is homogeneous function or not okay <coughs> when we calculate f of lambda x comma lambda y when we calculate f of lambda x comma lambda y if you will get the expression of the form lambda power n into f of x comma y then we say that it is a homogeneous function of degree n okay so when we calculate f of lambda x comma lambda y if you will get the expression of the form lambda power n into f of x comma y <coughs> then we say that it is a homogeneous function of degree n for checking this function is homogeneous function or not i will check f of lambda x comma lambda y okay that means for finding so first we have to find f of lambda x comma lambda y okay that means just we have to substitute x with lambda x by with lambda y in the given function okay now <coughs> f of lambda x comma lambda y tell me just we have to replace x with lambda x by with lambda y so y with lambda y so lambda y whole square plus 2 into lambda x into lambda y so which is equal lambda square y square plus 2 lambda square xy so which is equal to lambda square of y square plus 2xy okay so which is equal lambda square y square plus 2xy is nothing but f of xy so now which is in the form of f of lambda x comma lambda y is equal lambda square into f of x comma y so we can say that 
f of x comma y is a homogeneous function of degree. Tell me what is degree? Two. Okay. Clear. Ah. Now we will see another example. Okay. For example. f of x comma y is equal to sin x plus sin y sin x plus sin y okay ah uh, so for checking the given function is homogeneous function or not okay so first we have to find f of lambda x comma lambda y okay ah uh, if you observe that here can we take lambda can you write this expression in the form of lambda power n into f of x comma y you observe that here student can we take lambda from this expression can you write this expression in the form of lambda power n into f of x comma y no this expression we cannot write in the form of lambda power n into f of x comma y so you cannot write f of x comma y not equal to lambda power n into f of x comma y can you write this expression in the form of lambda power n into f of x comma y no so what do we say we say that this function is not homogeneous function not homogeneous function so now we will discuss about euler's theorem euler's theorem write down euler's theorem if f of x comma y is a homogeneous function homogeneous function of degree n in x and y hind highs continuous first and second order partial derivatives then then first one x do a by do x less y do a by do y is equal to n into f second one x square do square f by do x square plus 2xy do square f by do x do y plus y square do square f by do y square is equal to n into n minus 1 into f okay theorem without proof okay if f of x comma y is a homogeneous function of degree n in x and y and has continuous first and second order partial derivatives then x into do by do x plus y into do by do y is equal to n into f x square do square f by do x square plus 2xy do square f by do x do y plus y square do square f by do y square is equal to n into n minus 1 f okay Uh, here euler's theorem for homogeneous function okay euler's theorem for homogeneous function is defined as if f is a homogeneous function of degree n in x and y and also continuous first order and second order partial derivatives then x into do a by do x plus y into do a by do y is equal to nf x square do square f by do x square plus 2xy do square f by do x do y Plus y square do square by do y square is equal to n into n minus one f. So here, what is n? What is n? 
degree of function okay so here what is f f is a homogeneous function of degree n so here what is f f is a homogeneous function remember that point and degree what is degree n remember that point okay suppose u is a homogeneous function of degree n then by hylas theorem we can easily say that x into do u by do x plus y into do u by do y is equal to n into u similarly x square do square u by do x square plus 2xy do square f by do x do y plus y square do square u by do y square is equal to n into n minus 1 into u okay similarly z is a homogeneous function of degree n so then we can say that by hylas theorem x into do z by do x plus y into do z by do y is equal to n into dz similarly x square do square z by do x square plus 2xy do square f by do x do y plus y square do square z by do y square is equal to n into n minus 1 z that's all okay okay <clears throat> so now we will discuss about some problems okay write down problem show that very very simple problem show that the following the following functions by using Euler's theorem. Et means Euler's theorem. Euler's theorem. Okay. First one. If f of x comma y is equal to x cube plus y cube by x plus y, then st means show that x do y by do x plus y do y by do y is equal to 2f 2f okay very very simple problem okay so here given that f of x comma y is equal to x cube plus y cube by x plus y so then we have to show that x into do y by do x plus y into do y by do y is equal to 2f by using Euler's theorem so first we have to check this function is homogeneous function or not if the given function is homogeneous function so then find the degree of this function okay now let us check okay already we know that how to find uh, how to check homogeneous function or not okay for checking this function is homogeneous function or not i will check f of lambda x comma lambda y tell me lambda f of lambda x comma lambda y lambda cube x cube plus lambda cube y cube by x plus y sorry lambda x plus lambda y okay so here by taking lambda cube as a common factor in numerator and lambda as a common factor in denominator so here we get lambda cube of x cube plus y cube by lambda of x plus y so finally we get lambda square of x cube plus y cube by x plus y is nothing but f of x comma y therefore f is a homogeneous function of degree what is degree 2 therefore n is what 2 n is equal to 2 by by Euler's theorem we have by Euler's theorem we have tell me x do f by do x plus y do f by do y is equal to n into f what is n 2 into f second one write down if f of x comma y is equal to x square tan inverse of y by x 
minus y square tan inverse of x by y then show that x square dou square u by dou x square plus 2xy dou square u by dou x dou y plus y square dou square u by dou y square is equal to 2 into f okay uh, first you have to check the given function is homogeneous function or not okay uh, f of lambda x comma lambda y tell me lambda square x square tan inverse of lambda y by lambda x minus lambda square y square tan inverse of lambda x comma lambda y so here lambda 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 get cancelled so here by taking lambda square as a common factor so here we get lambda square of x square tan inverse of y by x minus y square of tan inverse of x by y which is equal lambda square of this is nothing but f of x comma y therefore f is a homogeneous function of degree of degree 2 therefore n is equal to 2 by Euler's theorem we have tell me x square dou square u by dou x square plus 2xy dou square u by dou x dou y plus y square dou square u by dou y square is equal to n into n minus 1 into f okay n is nothing but 2 into 2 minus 1 into f is nothing but 2 f Write down students, very very important problem. Third one, if u is equal tan inverse of x cube plus y cube, x cube plus y cube by x plus y, x cube plus y cube by x plus y, then prove that. First one, x do u by do x plus y do u by do y is equal to sine to u okay second one x square do square u by do x square plus 2xy do square u by do x do y plus y square do square u by do y square is equal to sin 4 u minus sin 2 u if u is equal to tan inverse of x cube plus y cube by x plus y then prove that first one x do u by do x plus y do u by do y is equal to sin to u second one x square do square u by do x square plus 2xy do square u by do x do y plus y square do square u by do y square is equal to sin 4 u minus sin to you uh, so here given that given that u is equal to tan inverse of x cube plus y cube by x plus y you can observe that here students this function is not homogeneous function because you cannot convert u into the form of u of lambda x comma lambda y is equal to lambda power n into u of x comma y if any doubt please check it okay so now to make this homogeneous function we can write it has tan u is equal to x cube plus y cube by x plus y Consider this function has f of x comma 
y. Now let us check. Now we have f of x comma y is equal to x cube plus y cube by x plus y. Now let us check this function f of x comma y is homogeneous function or not. Okay. For checking just to replace x by lambda x y by lambda y. Uh, so here we get tell me f of lambda x comma lambda y tell me lambda cube x cube plus lambda cube y cube by lambda x plus lambda y okay so this is nothing but lambda square of x cube plus y cube by x plus y is nothing but lambda square of f of x comma y therefore f is homogeneous function of degree what is degree 2 therefore n is equal to 2 ok so here f is a homogeneous function of degree 2 ok remember that point so here what is the what um, what is homogeneous function f is homogeneous function f is a homogeneous function of degree 2 that's all remember that point uh, if f is a homogeneous function of degree n then by Heiler's theorem we have by Heiler's theorem we have tell me x dou f by dou x plus y y dou f by dou y is equal to n into f so here f is a homogeneous function ok uh, therefore x into what is f f of x y is nothing but tan u please check it dou y dou x of what is f tan u please check it plus y into dou by dou y of tan u is equal to what is n to what is f tan u please check it ok ok uh, so now which is equal to x into uh, dou by dou x of tan u that means partial derivative of u with respect to x tell me ok so here for finding dou by dou x of tan u so here we have to use chain rule ok so first tell me derivative of tan 2x that means d by dx of tan 2x tell me secant secant square 2x again derivative of 2x 2 that means derivative of tan 2x is nothing but 2 secant square 2x okay uh, similarly partial derivative of tan u with respect to x tell me derivative of tan u secant square u secant square u again partial derivative of u with respect to x which is dou u by dou x okay partial derivative of u partial derivative of tan u with respect to x is secant square u again partial derivative of u with respect to x which is dou u by dou x okay partial derivative of tan u with respect to x is secant square u again partial derivative of u with respect to x is dou u by dou x please check it plus y tell me secant square u again dou u by dou y is equal to tan u okay uh, now so here by taking secant square u as a common factor in left hand side so here we get secant square u into x dou u by dou x plus y dou u by dou y is equal to tan u okay therefore x dou u by dou x plus y dou u by dou y is equal to 1 by secant square u to tan u 1 by secant square u is nothing but cos square u 
cos square u into 2 tan u. Okay. 2 tan u is nothing but sin u by cos u. Cos u cos u. Get cancelled. 2 sin u cos u is nothing but sin 2 u. Sin 2 u. Please check it. Okay. First one is completed. Now let us prove that second condition. Okay, so here for for proving second one, so here I will take first one. What is first one? X do u by do x plus y do u by do y is equal to sine two u. Let us name this as equation one. Uh, please listen very carefully. Uh, so now we have to partial derivative. Now partial derivative with respect to x. That means so now partially differentiate differentiate of 1 with respect to x tell me so now now we have to partially differentiate of equation 1 with respect to x tell me or let us apply dou by dou x on both sides of equation 1 so here we get dou by dou x of x dou u by dou x plus dou by dou x of y by dou u by dou y is equal to dou by dou x of sin 2 u. Uh, please listen very carefully. Uh, so here for finding dou by dou x of x to dou u by dou x. So here we have to use product rule. <coughs> product rule. Okay, hmm. that means x dou by dou x of dou u by dou x plus dou u by dou x of dou by dou x of x. So here I am using product rule, okay, derivative of uv is equal to u dash v plus uv dash. Uh, similarly, plus y dou by dou x of dou u by dou y plus dou u by dou y of dou by dou x into y. Tell me partial derivative of sin to u with respect to x. Tell me cos to u cos to u again derivative of to u with respect to x to dou u by dou x. Okay. Uh, so now which is equal to x x dou by dou x of dou u by dou x dou square u by dou x square plus dou u by dou x dou by dou x of x 1 plus y dou square u by dou x dou y plus plus dou u by dou y dou by dou x of y tell me dou by dou x of tell me dou by dou x of y tell me so here dou u by dou y dou partially derivative of y with respect to x is 0 because in this case y is constant please check it so which is equal to 2 cos 2u dou u by dou x ok so finally we get x dou square u by dou x square plus dou u by dou x plus y dou square u by dou x dou y is equal to cos 2 u dou u by dou x. Okay. So now let us multiply. So let us name this as equation 3. After that let us multiply both side by x. Okay. Multiply. Write down. Multiply both sides of equation 2 with with x tell me x square dou square u by dou x square plus x into dou u by dou x plus x y dou square u by dou x dou y is equal to 2x cos to u dou u by dou x okay okay by multiplying equation 2 by x so here we get we get x square 
डो स्क्वायर यू बाय डो एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस एक्स डो यू बाय डो एक्स प्लस एक्स वाय डो स्क्वायर यू बाय डो एक्स डो वाय इज इक्वल टू एक्स कास टू यू डो यू बाय डो एक्स लेट एज नेम दिस इज इक्वेशन थ्री ओके सिमिलरली पार्सली डिफरेंटिएट ऑफ इक्वेशन वन विथ रेस्पेक्ट टू वाई पार्सली डिफरेंटिएट सॉरी ऑफ इक्वेशन वन विथ रेस्पेक्ट टू वाई ओके टेलमी डो बाई डो वाई ऑफ एक्स इन टू डो यू बाय डो एक्स प्लस डो बाय डो वाय ऑफ वाई इन टू डो यू बाय डो वाय इज इक्वल डो बाय डो वाय ऑफ साइन टू यू ओके सो हियर आई एम राइटिंग डायरेक्टली ओके हाँ टेल मी डो बाय डो वाय ऑफ एक्स डो यू बाय डो एक्स टेल मी सो हियर एक्स इज कांस्टेंट ओके x डो स्क्वेर यू बाय डो वाय डो एक्स दट साल प्लस डो वाय डो वाय ऑफ वाई वन डो बाय डो वाय ऑफ डो यू बाय डो वाय इज नथिंग बट डो स्क्वेर यू बाय डो वाय स्क्वेर इज नथिंग बट डो यू बाय डो वाय प्लस वाई इन टू डो स्क्वेर यू बाय डो वाय स्क्वेर प्लीज चेक इट सो डो बाई डो बाई ऑफ साइन टू यू इज नथिंग बट टू खास टू यू डो यू बाय डो वाई सो नेक्स्ट लेट एज मल्टीप्लाई ओके लेट एज नेम दिस इज इक्वेशन फोर सो नेक्स्ट मल्टीप्लाइंग थ्रो आउट इक्वेशन बाय थ्रो आउट इक्वेशन फोर बाय वाई मल्टीप्लाई मल्टीप्लाई बाय वाई ओके मल्टीप्लाई Throw out equation four by y. So here we get x y do square u by do y do x plus y do u by do y plus y square do square u by do y square is equal two y cos two u do u by do y. Let us name this as equation five. Now let us add equation three and equation five. By adding equation three and five, so here we get. Okay, by adding equation three and five. Now, so here we get. What is equation three? X square, do square u by do x square plus x do u by. डो एक्स प्लस एक्स वाय डो स्क्वेर यू बाय डो एक्स डो वाय इज इक्वल टू एक्स कास टू यू डो यू बाय डो एक्स ओके दिस इज इक्वेशन थ्री इक्वेशन फाइव टेल मी ओके सो हियर वाई स्क्वायर सो हियर आई एम राइटिंग इक्वेशन फाइव वाई स्क्वायर डो यू डो स्क्वेर यू बाय डो वाई स्क्वायर प्लस वाय डो यू बाय डो वाय प्लस एक्स वाय डो स्क्वेर यू बाय डो वाय डो एक्स इज इक्वल टू वाय कास टू यू डो यू बाय डो वाय सो हियर दिस इज नथिंग बट एक्स स्क्वायर डो स्क्वेर यू बाय डो एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस वाई स्क्वायर डो स्क्वेर यू बाय डो वाय स्क्वायर प्लस x do u by do x plus y do u by do y plus ah uh, students please remember here do square u by do x do y x y do square u by do x do y x y do square u by do y do x is nothing but two x y do square u by do x do y because u x y is equal to u y x okay Write down directly, no problem here. Okay. So here u x y is equal to u y x. Okay. X y u x y 
plus x y u x y is nothing but x two x y u x y. Okay, write down directly, no problem. Uh, so here, two x cos to u do u by do x plus two y cos to u do u by do y is nothing but two cos two u of x do u by do x plus y do u by do y. Okay. So first we have to add. After that, take two cos two as a common factor. Okay. Hmm. Uh, here, x square do square u by do x square plus two x y do square u by do x do y plus y square do square u by do y square plus x do x do u by do x plus y do u by do y. Tell me, already we know that x do u by do x plus y do u by do y is nothing but sine to u. This is sine to u is equal to cos to u. This is nothing but sine to u. Okay, two cos to u sine to u. That means two sine to u cos to u. Tell me. Okay, sine to x is equal to two sine x cos x. Sine four x. Tell me. Sine four x is equal to two sine two x cos two x. Okay, so this is nothing but sine four u. Sine four u. Okay. So finally, we get x square do square u by do x square plus two x y do square u by do x do y plus y square do square u by do y square is equal to sine four u minus sine two u. Okay. Write down. So here I am writing x square u x x plus two x y u x y plus y square u y y. Is it called sine four u minus sine two u? Okay. Very very important problem. Please remember it. Please do practice. So now I will give you some problems regarding to Euler's theorem. Okay, write down. Very very simple. Show that the following functions by using E.T. means Euler's theorem. First one, if z is equal to x y of f of x by y then show that x do z by do x plus y do z by do y is equal to 2z if z is equal to x cube plus y cube divided by under root of x plus y under root of x plus y then show that x do z by do x plus y do z by do y is equal to phi by two z phi by two z if z is equal to log of x cube plus y cube by x plus y then show that x do z by do x y do z by do y is equal to 2 fourth one if z is equal to sin inverse of x cube minus y cube by x minus y then show that x do z by do x y do z by do y is equal to 2 tan z 2 tan z 2 tan z <coughs> fifth one If z 
जेड इज इक्वल टैन इनवर्स ऑफ अंडर रूट ऑफ एक्स पॉवर फोर प्लस वाई पॉवर फोर देन शो दैट देन शो दैट फर्स्ट वन एक्स डोजेड बाय डो एक्स प्लस वाई डोजेड बाय डो वाई इज इक्वल साइन टू जेड साइन टू जेड एक्स स्क्वायर डो स्क्वायर जेड बाय डो एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस टू एक्स वाई डो स्क्वायर जेड बाय डो एक्स डो वाई प्लस वाई स्क्वायर डो स्क्वायर जेड बाय डो वाई स्क्वायर इज इक्वल साइन फोर जेड माइनस साइन टू जेड ओके वी हैव टू फॉलो सेम प्रोसीजर ओके